I am so thankful for my high school experience. From the good times to the bad times, I had the ability to grow as an individual. And looking back, I am so grateful for how every experience has shaped me as a person. And I just wanna say that every minute, every moment, and every hard time is a learning experience. So please absorb everything you can because it's over so quickly. One time the bus didn't show up for an FFA competition and Mr. Colby, Mr. Davis, and Mrs. Lasky all dropped everything just to bring us in their own vehicles. This is pretty much an example of my entire time at Cobra. The entire staff is so ready and willing to do anything for their students. I am really going to miss this school and everyone in it. Do not take yourself too seriously. Go out and have fun with your friends. Don't give them a regret if you don't. Go do that silly winter carnival event that seems stupid, but it's going to be super fun and the memories will last a lifetime. My advice is to put yourself out there and not care about what other people think. Um, just do what makes you happy because um, in the end it will make your high school experience so much better. Don't fail. One thing that I've learned as a senior is that high school goes by really quick, so make sure you enjoy it. I would like to thank everyone that works at Co-Brown, from all the teachers, cafeteria workers, custodians, and administrators. Everyone has made Co-Brown my second home the past four years. I am so grateful I am part of such an amazing community. The best advice I have given as a senior is going to be a cliche, but do not wish it away. You think that the next four years is going to be so long and so awful, but it really does go by fast, especially the way that we're ending our senior year makes it even more surreal. So definitely cherish every single moment you have, even like the bad memories, cherish everything about your high school experience and most importantly have fun with it because it'll end before you know it. For seniors, just be proud of what you did. Everything, like, <laughs> you made it. And for future seniors, you can do it if, if you do not do it. Um, Cole Brown taught me so much. You guys gave me a place when I needed one. You gave me a home. And I hope all my teachers the best in life. I hope all my fellow graduates the best in life. I love you all. The best advice I can give as a senior is to not take your four years for granted because it goes by a lot faster than you'd expect. Thank you to all the teachers who have ever helped me throughout my high school career. I'm gonna really miss going to Cole Brown. Always be yourself and stay true to who you are because people will love you for you, and the people that don't aren't the people you want in your life. And it is very important to have a big, strong group of friends who will encourage you through high school, and they'll make you happy, and they won't make you sad or judge you. And fortunately for me, I chose that path of choosing the right friends, and it has benefited me throughout high school. We all procrastinate and delay our work, but if you stay focused and work hard on getting all your components in on time and your work done on time, then it's so relieving and easier at the end when it's all done. My advice to freshmen is that it gets worse before it gets better. Freshman year, you don't know what you're doing. Sophomore year, work gets worse. Junior year is awful for work because it's preparing you for college. And senior year's workload is better, but you have to deal with senior portfolio. Hi, just wanted to say thank you to my classmates and teachers for making this year great. Thought I'd show everyone my new little baby horse, Sebastian. He was born during COVID. Oh, Brad, I tell my junior year because I didn't move to Barrington until the Sunday before. It was a tough transition for me because I didn't know anyone, but I'm so thankful for the welcoming community that Co Brown has made. I'm thankful for the opportunity to come to Co Brown, the friends that I have made, and the wonderful community that I was able to be a part of. Go with the flow. That's about it. Thank you. To Miss Fenerty. I had her my junior and senior year for English, and she made the class absolutely amazing. I don't think I would have enjoyed it if it wasn't for her. And that's coming from someone who loves English. Um, she actually is one of the main reasons why I want to go to college for, to be an English teacher. My advice to all seniors is to just live in the moment, 
be in the present and enjoy everything that's happening. Uh, create so many memories and take pictures of everything that you do and everywhere you go with all of your friends and just be involved in a lot of the things at school and in and out of the community. As a senior, the best advice I can give is to be outgoing. I know that most of you have probably already heard this before, but it is really important. Freshman year, I hardly participated in anything extracurricular at Co-Brown, and I really regret it in the future. I saw what my friends were doing and uh, what they were participating in, and I really wanted to be a part of that. So talk to people, join clubs and sports, uh, and just try to make the best experience for yourself that you can at Co-Brown. My advice is to be yourself. Don't try to be someone else just to fit into a certain group, as well as have fun. You get one true high school experience, and trust me, when it's over, you're going to miss it. If I could give one piece of advice to the underclassmen, it would be to join an activity, a sport, anything at Co-Brown, because it definitely helps you find friends and find what you love to do. Hi everyone, I wanted to thank all the teachers I've had over the years for their constant support and the Cobran community for being so awesome. I wanted to thank my family and my friends for always being there. It's been an amazing journey. Hi guys, I hope you didn't get those final few days on campus to say thank you and goodbye to all the people that meant something to us over our four years at Cobran. So I just wanted to say thank you to all my teachers over the years because every single one of you have taught me some sort of life lesson. And I also just want to thank everyone who has helped me through my rough times and made me into the person I am today. Just um, enjoy high school and senior year especially. Um, it's something that's really important in your life and it's a very important milestone. Um, and definitely in high school, you have some amazing memories and you make the best friends. And it's just something that's really special and just cherish it because it does go by like really fast. Thank you, Co Brown, for an amazing four years. I wanna thank my teachers, classmates, coaches, and teammates, and especially the Co Brown softball team for pushing me to be my best and work so hard for what I wanted. I'm so grateful for the amazing friendships I've made and just the perspective I've gained over these four years. In high school, you should learn to do things for yourselves and not others. If I could give anybody one piece of advice, it would be to not sacrifice your grades for a fun time. Throughout my senior year and whole high school experience, I did nothing but that putting video games and people before my schoolwork. Don't be like me. Get your work done early and relax after. It's the best thing you can do for yourself. The best advice I can give as a senior is enjoy the time now, enjoy high school, because after high school, you're not gonna be seeing the friends you grew up with since kindergarten anymore. It's gonna be new friends, new faces, and as Andy Bernard best said, I really wish there was a way to know when we're in the good times before the good times have actually left. Hey! First, I want to thank all of my teachers. Second is I have a memory to share. I was sitting in biology class taking notes, so I was like looking down at my sheet of paper as Mr. Zink was talking about, I think it might have been inertia or something like that. Um, and so to demonstrate, he threw a marker to the kids sitting next to me to show like it's stopping. Well, needless to say, it didn't make it to the kid next to me and the marker bounced right off the top of my head. And that's honestly like one of my favorite memories from biology just because I thought it was hilarious. Get all of your portfolio stuff done as early as possible. Because the, early, the earlier you do it, the more time you have to just chill the rest of your senior year instead of having to worry about deadlines and, and getting all your stuff done. And like, I did not do that. I left all my stuff to the last minute and that's not fun either. So yeah, that is my advice. Get all of your portfolio stuff done early. Also join the cross country team. Even though I didn't get to actually close out my senior year at Co Brown, I'm grateful that I had those other four years. Because during those four years, I feel like Co Brown had prepared me really well for the future ahead, and I feel fortunate that I was given that opportunity. Do not spread yourself too thin between your friend groups when you're going to be making tons of friends throughout your freshman year. 
and you don't want to spread yourself too thin so that you make a bunch of just like people that you don't know but you know their names at least when you walk through the hallways make some quality friends because that's that's going to be your base of support throughout the rest of your high school career I want to say thank you to all of our teachers and faculty for making the past four years so special and so memorable. Thank you. You will always hold a close place in my heart. If I could give any advice to an incoming freshman, it would have to be to go all out at Winter Carnival. Those are some of my most fond memories of Cole Brown and some of the funnest times that I had as a school. So embrace it, enjoy it, and you'll get the hang of it. So one of the best experiences I've had at Cole Brown was the initial day at freshman orientation. All the teachers were very welcoming and it's difficult but I'm never going to see that place again. Another piece of advice is uh, do your work. Do it on time. You don't want to be dealing with the detention, Saturday schools. You want to get your stuff in and you don't want to be stressing about it. I've had an amazing and unforgettable experience these past four years at Cole Brown and I've learned things from school as well as new things about myself and definitely have enjoyed my time there. But I don't think that any of that would have been possible without all of the amazing teachers. So I just wanted to say thank you for making me into a better student and a better person. Go with the flow, don't stress about the little stuff, and enjoy your time as much as you can. My best Cobra memory is definitely either at soccer camp or cross country camp. They're all so fun, and I would definitely miss that the most. I only got one thing. My boys. You don't stress out about the senior portfolio. Coming into senior year, that was probably the most overwhelming thing for most seniors, and it was especially for me, because I didn't know what was required of it. But once I figured out when the deadlines were, it turned out to not be as much work as it seemed to be. And choose a project that you're passionate about and you enjoy. This way, it won't seem like a project that's actually required by the school. It'll all turn out to be much easier for you in the end. To work hard, especially for my ladies out there. Um, just know that you can do anything a guy can do. And sometimes even better because, you know, girls can add a little sparkle here and there. Thank, thank you, Cole Brown, for a great high school experience. Shout out to Mr. Usinger and Mr. Carrier for being my favorite math teachers. Shout out to Ms. Farinity for being the best English teacher ever. Get involved in school and school activities like sports and clubs, stuff like that. Um, I have played basketball, volleyball, and softball throughout my high school career, and I don't regret any of it because I've made a lot of friends and um, strong connections that way, so I would highly recommend getting involved. Try your best in all your work because even if it's your last year, it's still like the most important year and to not take your last year for granted, no matter how much you want to get out, it's probably one of the most memorable years, and it may be like the last year of school, so. I just wanted to express my gratitude to Mr. O'Rourke. Mr. O'Rourke, you've taught me a lot in the last three years that I've had you. Uh, your classes are always very enjoyable and thought-provoking, and I'm really going to miss them when I go off to college. To enjoy your time while it lasts, because it goes really fast, and it'll be over before you so freshmen, I would advise you not to ask seniors where your classes are because some seniors do like to play jokes on you and tell you the wrong classes to go to. Um, sophomores and juniors, you know, just try and stay low, keep your head down, don't start any fights. Thanks to the teachers, family, friends, and everyone else that's been around me these past four years and for making them so memorable and awesome and for always having me strive to do my best. And I also wanted to give a quick shout out to Mr. Carrier for being my go-to math tutor for these past four years and for always giving me the best advice. Thanks everyone. I would say you should stay present in the moment and tell people how grateful you are for them. If I could give one piece of advice to upcoming seniors, I'd tell them to not let the year get away from them because it goes by really fast. Don't take your senior year for granted. Just enjoy your senior year while you can because it goes by fast and um, don't take anything for granted. I've had the best four years of my life here so far um, and I have countless memories that I'll never forget. So. 
Thank you for everything, Cobram. And to take every single day like it's your last because you never know when it will actually be your last day. And I feel like I should have done that before all of this happened. The best advice I can give as a senior is if you're gonna join a club, join it your freshman year, because I joined FFA my sophomore year and missed a lot with my friends freshman year, so. I just wanna thank everybody who helped me get through the last four years. It's been a wild ride, but we finally made it. Shout out to Miss Burns for being there every step of the way um, through the tough times and the good times. I also want to give an extra special thanks to Miss Barry. Miss Barry, you were there for me through everything. You know about my past, and you have helped and pushed me to strive to be a better me. Um, I know you weren't my actual teacher, but I'm so glad that I had a chance to meet you and become close. Um, I feel like I could talk to you about anything, and you're always there to give great advice. Um, thanks, thank you so much for the both of you for being there. I couldn't ask for anything. As a senior, uh, my advice is to get out of your comfort zone and try new things, and just try to like make the best of high school, because it only happens once. Something that I've learned throughout high school is that you need to do what makes you happy without having to offer any defense to anybody and then surround yourself with people that support you in what you do. Don't wish it away because time flies and four years goes just like that. So just enjoy it while you can. Don't wish it away at all. The best advice I could give you going into Co Brown would to be join a team or a club, anything of that sort, because you get to meet new people. It's a great way to spend your time because you're doing something you like. My best advice as a senior is don't be afraid to make new friends from the towns that you didn't grow up in. You will be surprised on who you meet. A home isn't just a place. It's a group of people. Thank you to everyone in the Cole Brown family over these last four long years for truly making Cole Brown my home time with friends and being involved in performing arts ensembles. So, fellow seniors, let's try to live by the mantra that Headmaster says every assembly. Today is a great day for being grateful for the things we have and not worrying about the things we don't have. And on that note, have a good Friday.